Okay, so welcome to Math Storia and let's solve this problem. So using calculator to find the value of the following, then only two decimal places. So for this cosine 85 degrees, so we have cosine, then 85 degrees equals, since only two decimal places, so that's 0 0.09. So cosine 85 is equal to 0 0.09. Then for the sine 7 degrees, so we have sine, then 7 degrees equals, so that's 0 0.12. So this one is 0 0.12. Then for this tangent 35 degrees, so we have tangent, then 35 degrees equals, that's 0 0.70. So tangent 35 is 0 0.70. And this cosine 65 degrees, so that's cosine, then 65 degrees equals the 0 0.42 so this cosine 65 is 0 0.42 and this tangent 23 degrees so tangent then 23 degrees equals the 0 0.42 so tangent 23 is also 0 0.42 then for this problem, so using the degrees, minutes, and seconds button, then give the answers to the nearest minute. So for this 17.8 degrees, so we have 17.8, then degree minute seconds, equals that 17 degrees and 48 minutes. So this one is 17 degrees and 48 minutes then for this 48.52 degrees so we have 48 then point 52 then degrees equals so since around uh, off to the nearest minute so that's 48 degrees and 31 minutes so this one is 48 degrees and 31 minutes. Then for this 63.7 degrees, so we have 63, then point 0.7, then degrees equals, so that's 63 degrees and 42 minutes. So this one is 63 degrees and 42 minutes. Then for this 108.33 degrees, so we have 108.33 degrees, then equals, so since to the nearest minute and seconds is more than 30, so therefore this 19 becomes 20 minutes. So we have 108 degrees and 20 minutes. So this one is 108 degrees and 20 minutes. And this 35.24 degrees. So we have 35, then point 24 degrees. So equals, since this one is less than uh, 30 seconds, so therefore the final answer is 35 degrees and 14 minutes so we have 35 degrees and 14 minutes then for this problem so find the size of angle theta then to the nearest degree so for sine theta equals 0 0.529 so we have sine theta so inverse or shift sine then 0 0.529 equals then this degree minute seconds so that's 31 degrees and 56 minutes 
since to the nearest degree and this 56 minutes is more than 30 minutes so therefore this 31 degrees becomes 32 degrees then for this cosine theta equals 0 0.493 so we have shift then cosine then 0 0.493 equals then this degree minute seconds so that's 60 degrees and 27 minutes since 27 minutes that's less than 30 minutes so therefore the final answer is 60 degrees so this one is equal to 60 degrees then for tangent theta equals 1.8 so for tangent, so we have shift, then tangent, then 1.8 equals, then this degree minute seconds. So that's 60 degrees and 56 minutes. So since 56 minutes, that's more than 30 minutes and round off to the nearest degree. So this 60 degrees becomes 61 degrees. So this one is equal to 61 degrees. Then for the sine theta equals 0 0.256. So we have shift, then sine, then 0 0.256 equals, then this degree minute seconds. That's 14 degrees and 49 minutes since 49 minutes so this 14 degrees becomes 15 degrees so this one is 15 degrees then for tangent uh, theta equals 0 0.725 so we have shift then tangent then 0 0.725 equals then this degree minute seconds so 36 degrees and 56 minutes so since 56 minutes so therefore this 35 degrees becomes 36 degrees so this one is equal to 36 degrees then for this given so find the measure of angle theta then to the nearest minute so for sine theta is equal to 0 0.9 so we have this shift then sine 0 0.9 equals then degree minute seconds so that's 64 degrees and 9 minutes then 29.04 seconds since to the nearest minute and seconds is not greater than 30 so therefore the final answer is 64 degrees and 9 minutes so this one is 64 degrees and 9 minutes then for this cosine 0 0.013 so we have shift then cosine 0 0.013 equals then this degree minute seconds so that's 89 degrees and 15 minutes and 18.48 seconds since only 18 seconds so therefore the final answer is 89 degrees and 15 minutes so this one is 89 degrees and 15 minutes then for tangent theta equals 0 0.958 so we have shift then tangent then 0 0.958 equals then this degree minute seconds so we have 43 degrees and 46 minutes since seconds is only 16 seconds so therefore the final answer 43 degrees and 46 minutes so 43 degrees and 46 minutes and for this cosine theta equals 0 
0.501. So we have shift, then cosine, then 0 0.501 equals, then this degree minute seconds. So that's 59 degrees and 56 minutes. So this one is 59 degrees and 56 minutes. And for tangent theta equals 2.3. So we have shift, then tangent, then 2.3 equals in this degree minute seconds. So that's 63 degrees and 30 minutes. So this one is 66 degrees and 30 minutes.